We begin with a 7 News update to a story out of Central. Members of that community are trying to protect their neighborhood from being overdeveloped. They're working on a solution they have been for months. 7 News reporter Asia Wilson tells us their plan. People in this historically black neighborhood say they have found a developer who is willing to work with them to help the alley grow in a way that is good for everyone. Whether it's the kids playing or people gathering. The church I grew up in, all of us grew up in, it's in this community. Some say these 14 acres in Central are more than just a community. It means something to not just us, but the Hispanics and the whites that stay in this neighborhood too. This is who has helped made Central what it is. The alley, also known as the Headtown neighborhood, a place some say has a vulnerable population, is up for sale. Residents know it as the store. Some have been concerned about the nearly 14 households, around 50 people who live here. Not having anywhere to go, because really in the area around here, there's not enough uh, working people in this area that makes the amount of money that need to, to move elsewhere. For months, groups like Naturally Occurring Affordable Housing have worked to save the alley. Now they have help. So the developer Holiday Ventures wants the people who live here to be able to stay and he's proposed a plan that would build um, affordable housing, so apartments, single family homes, townhomes, a park, a playground, a splash park, a dog park. The group is also working with Habitat for Humanity. They're willing to build here so the people who rent right here could become homeowners. Community leaders say the proposed plan could also include a grocery store to address food desert issues. Central do need to be built up. I must admit that, but not to lose a people. All things Alicia says are uplifting to this historic community. It does bring hope and everything to see something you grew up in. Don't want to be tore down. A group leader tells me right now this property is not zoned to have high density apartments, so next they will work with the city on zoning changes. In Central Asia Wilson, 7 News. In fact, at that last point, we talked to the mayor of Central who said none of that development can begin until the current owner petitions the city to rezone the property.